Hello, everyone, and welcome to this edition of the Get Growing Live Weekly Work Session with Get Oiling. I am Coach Ashley. Uh, Greg is traveling this week. He'll be back with you next week uh, with all of us here. Uh, and uh, today we have a very special topic. We're going to be talking about websites, which sounds like a really simple topic, but in fact, it is not. Today we're going to talk about websites that work right? Because there's a lot of guesswork in this business. Uh, maybe a quick show of hands if you're here. Um, are you a professional website developer or editor or someone who works online in that regard? Is that a background that you have? See, it's not common, right? It's not common for us to know everything that we need to know walking in the door. We're here to share a great idea, a great product that's changed our lives with the world. So uh, we're going to demystify today some of the aspects of a website that works and how to use one. Uh, before we get started, go ahead, uh, if you're tuning in live, uh, say hello, let us know where you're coming in from. I'm really excited to work with you guys today. Um, just a little bit of housekeeping if you're brand new. This is a free session. We do this every week on Thursdays at noon Eastern uh, as a way to help everyone who is a Get Oiling, I'm sorry, who is a Young Living <laughs> distributor and who is also a Get Oiling member, although you don't have to be a Get Oiling member to join these calls and to learn. There's actually quite a lot that you'll learn today that you'll benefit from even if you aren't currently using our membership. But if you'd like to get started with us, you can head over to getoiling.com. Today, you can get started for $1 for your first month. All right, so good to see you guys. Come on over in the chat. Let's hear where you're coming in from. I'm going to go ahead and start sharing my slides and we'll get right into it. All right, if I could get a quick hand up, let me know that you can see my slides. I'm going to take my face out of the picture here. All right, perfect. Hey, good to see you guys. Got some familiar faces. Haven't seen in a while here. Awesome. All right, so today we are talking about Young Living Distributor websites that work. That work is a pretty important uh, distinguishing factor here because many of us do have a website. Matter of fact, after our little welcome here, I want to ask you guys, quick poll, maybe, maybe just a show of hands. Do you currently have a Young Living website? Do you, do you have a site that you uh, use or would hope to use to share Young Living um, and to grow Young Living as a business? Perfect. All right, so we've got some who do, some who don't. Now, let me ask you this, and maybe this is more of a hypothetical. Um, I mean, is it, or, or actually this shouldn't be. <laughs> is this something that you regularly use to successfully grow? Your, your, your website. You, so actually, when everyone gets started with Young Living, you actually have a replicated distributor website, right? That is something that you do use in a more, uh, you know, hands-on, step-by-step fashion to, say, sign up your new members, right? Or to point people back to the site, to take advantage of promotions and things like that. See, we all actually have a website, but outside of directly taking someone there to sign them up for their premium starter kit, is it, do we have a website that we use to help us grow our business, and which, which is a more holistic view, right? For the, an, the answer for most of us is going to be no here, um, because what we typically think of when we get a website is it's, it's just something that our name is on that promotes a thing that maybe you know helps us do the explaining a little better, right? Well, today we're gonna talk about what you actually need to have on a website and how you can really use it to successfully grow your business. Because see, having a website the right kind and set up in the right way is really a critical step toward establishing you as the credible resource that people come to, right? Because just having a website doesn't cut it. This isn't a, if you build it, they will come scenario. Um, there's a strategy to it and it doesn't have to be complicated. Now today we're going to learn why you need your own website for Young Living, the five elements of a fantastic website, simple, easy website upgrades, how to turn your website into a real business tool that actually helps you grow your business, and how you can get your own fantastic site for just $1. All right, so what is 
a website to me anyway? Why do I need one beyond what Young Living has given me when I signed up as a distributor? First, there are literally millions of distributors who have basically the exact same website. And even if you go to replica replicated website services, and there are quite a few out there, uh, and that's actually how Get Oiling got started. We started out as a replicated website service for Young Living distributors. We do still fill that function for a lot of people. What a lot of people don't know, however, is that we have a complete suite for you to completely plug in and grow your business and set yourself apart. But we'll talk about that later. So to have your own website, the benefit first is differentiation. This is you. This is your home on the web. It also displays your credibility. There are things that you know that others don't and people who trust you want to learn from you. This is a place where you can see that happen. It also builds authority. Again, placing what you know out there, sharing your credibility with enough people over time establishes you as an authority, right? This is also branding and all of these things really kind of connect together because branding at its core definition is showing up the same way in a multitude of places and controlling the message that is shared where you show up. Also automation. This is probably one of the most important components that we can talk about in terms of using a website to help you grow your Young Living business because there's so much person-to-person, one-to-one working in your business that happens in this business model inherently that we are not seeing a way that's possible for us to work on our business instead on a business that works for us when we aren't there personally. So automation creates leverage and websites help build leverage into your business, which helps you get your time back. And also, finally, this is really important. And this is a lesson that I learned the hard way early on in my first round in network marketing. Owning is better than renting. And what I'm talking about here is you can have a following on social media. You can have a massive following on social media, but you don't own it. When you want to send a message out, you can't control whether or not people see it, right? Even if you own a group, on Facebook. You can't control whether or not someone sees what you post in there. Am I right? So when you have a website, you have a means of controlling how your message gets out and building an asset and audience that is your own. All right. Now let's talk about the elements of a great website. First, clarity of message. This is really important. When you're going to set out to edit your own website, if you have one, uh, or if you're going to create one, or if you're going to build into a template, it's really important that you're super clear on your message. And I'm going to break each of these elements down separately. So, uh, so hold tight on this. The next thing we wanna make sure that we have in place is easy navigation. It's easy for people to see what they wanna see and know where to go next. You also need to have authentic and valuable content. This is critical. Again, we'll talk about this in just a second. You also need a strong and clear call to action. This is something that most of us are missing. And it's, uh, and, and this, this is true across our business. A lot of us are timid about telling people what to do to take the next step. Uh, and then finally, lead magnets, which are these this really cool thing that's really simple to create if you know something that others don't, which you do, everyone here does. You can create something and then have an exchange of information. Uh, and we'll talk about what that means again here in just a second. So let's start with the first, clarity of message, getting those first things first in place. So getting clear, who is it that you wanna help? Before you even set out to write something on a website, write a blog post, share something anywhere on social media, uh, or to, to, to write in your about me section on a website, right? You have to figure out first, who are you speaking to? And who is it that you wanna help? One of the easiest tricks to figuring this out is to ask yourself who you were and where you were before you found Young Living, right? You discovered something when you discovered this company, when you discovered the products, when you discovered the opportunity and some things changed in you and they have changed the course of your life and you are now headed in a better direction than you were when you started, right? 
talk to the you before you found this answer. That's the easiest way to decide who it is that you're talking to. Because then you know and you're confident that because you've walked that walk, there are people who have been in the shoes that you were in before you found this transformative opportunity and product line, right? Speak to that person. All right, now what problems are that person looking, is that problem look, looking to solve? Or is that person, excuse my words today, need the coffee. <laughs> what problems are the you from prior to Young Living looking to solve? And how can you help them solve those problems? So before you discovered Young Living, or did you have health uh, struggles? Did you have mindset struggles? Did you have financial struggles? Did you have personal struggles? How did you go about overcoming them? What answers were you looking for? Or what answers did you need before you were able to overcome those things? Right? Start thinking about that because you are going to be, when you get clear on this, you're going to be speaking directly to that past you to help that person get to where you are today faster than it took you to get there. So establish what are they looking to solve and how can you help them solve it? And then really most importantly, before we go out creating a web page, making a blog post, writing an email, writing a Facebook post, ask yourself why. Why would they care? Why would they click through? Why would they read more? Or why would they trust you with their contact information? See, the primary function of your website is not promotion. And this is true for your social media as well. We must serve others first because trust is earned. And once trust is established, sharing is simple and easy, right? When someone trusts you and what you have to say, no matter who they are or how you established a relationship, when you have developed trust with them because you have helped them, you have provided them something of value, asking for nothing in exchange other than perhaps their contact information, right? Once you have established that trust, when you say, listen, you've benefited from this help that I've provided you, let me help you a little further and give you a recommendation on a product line that changed the outcomes of the issues I was facing with my wellness. Obviously, use your compliant language, right? <laughs> but, um, but once you establish that trust and the words that you use, wherever you're putting it on your website, um, then it's very easy for people to say yes when you ask them if they've got 15 minutes to look at something that could change their life too. All right? So the next part, the next aspect of a fantastic website is navigation. So giving people an opportunity to dig deeper. Uh, you wanna make sure that the information that you have on a website is easy to get to, easy to find, and make sense, right? So keeping people's attention is something that we all struggle to do online. The average person in this modern age has the attention span of a goldfish. It's about six to eight seconds. So you want to make sure that obviously you're grabbing information, you're grabbing uh, attention with relevant information and speaking clearly to the person that you want to help. But it's also really important that if they want to find out more, it's really easy for them to see where they need to go next. Otherwise, they're going to go somewhere else, right? So ask yourself, where can more information be found and how can I direct them more clearly to it? Uh, are there links, are there resources, are there videos, are there additional blog posts, and so on? What are the resources that you wanna point people to and how can you easily point them toward it? And then what's the next step in the process? Again, having these things in mind helps to basically allow your website to hold a prospect's hand walking through the process of getting educated enough to be ready to see a presentation and say yes to their premium starter kit and essential rewards, right? All your website is really doing here, if we look at it in, in this context, is being you, but when you're not there, right? So think about what the next steps are. What, from a navigational perspective, where, what's step one, step two, step three, step four? There are ways that you can deliver information that duplicates your efforts when you're not there. And then of course you can do this because it's a website, you can do this for as many people as can visit it at once and forever, right? And then make sure you're really clear on what's next. Again, keeping this sequential when you're thinking about how you wanna share, um, making sure that it's clear and easy for people to get to where they need to go next. So make sure that you put yourself in their shoes. 
what's the flow? How do you go about sharing and how can you put that into a website format? And how can they easily learn more without it taking a long time to figure out because we will lose them <laughs> in under six seconds if it's confusing, right? So keep it simple. All right. Now, this is really important, you guys. Content. This is the cornerstone of your website because again, this isn't just about promotion. It's actually for the majority of time, not about promotion at all. We'll call it the 80-20 rule. The majority of what you need to have on your website in the form of blogs and, and resources and educational information is in fact not promoting Young Living products outright or the premium starter kit or essential rewards. It's sharing relevant information with your prospects. You remember that person we talked about just a few slides ago? You, before you discovered Young Living? How can you help that person? Content is the way you help that person. So through content, and, and by content, you guys, uh, I, I think the easiest way if in the context of a website to explain that to you is through a blog, right? It could also be through a newsletter. If you get people to sign up for your newsletter and they just receive that content, maybe as a newsletter in their inbox once a week. Uh, but a blog is a really great way to get people following you online and consuming more information from you and building trust, credibility, and authority automatically right, on an, on an automated basis. So in your content, you're building your trust, your credibility, your authority. You're showing people that you're there to help first. They don't land on your website and say, oh, well, she's here to sell to me. I'm good. I don't want anything right now. Bye-bye. And then they don't read anything, right? With your content, you can show that you're there to help them first. Show them that you know how to help them because you've been where they are, right? It also allows others to get to know you. You can add your own anecdotes, your stories, your experience to what you're sharing, and it adds so much to others being able to relate to you and trust you and want to know what those next steps are, want to know what your secret is. Please share with me what it is that you're doing because they're ready to know, right? And you can also become known for your passion and expertise so that people start to seek you out. So it's not just about land on this page and then my email sequence is going to tell you what to do. They can read enough of a blog post and say, okay, I'm, I'm ready. I don't know what it is that you're doing, but please tell me, right? And they can reach out to you personally. You got a phone call, bam, you got a new member, right? You can create this if you put yourself out there first with valuable content, serving the growth and benefit of others. See, you know enough, everyone here right now, everyone watching this right now, you know enough right now to transform someone's life because yours was transformed, was it not? You know enough right now to transform a life. What if you could transform many lives at a time all around the world? That's what you can do when you have a website that shares content that speaks directly to a person that wants to solve a problem and weaves in your authentic story, your journey of how you can help that person get from A to B. And if you can provide a clear point of how they can get from A to B, they will absolutely follow you to that presentation and say yes when it's time to get that premium starter kit and get onto essential rewards. Now, Another step, and this is a critical one as well, this is one that most of us are not getting quite right, both on our websites and in the way that we're generally operating in our business. Action is imperative. We have to get people to do what we need them to do. So are you sharing for the sake of it, just to share? Or are you sharing to make a real difference, right? Every single person that I have met who is sharing Young Living is not in it for the money. Obviously the money is a lovely and abundant side effect of sharing something that matters, right? But you're in this to make a difference. You can change lives. This changed your life. You're out to change others' lives. You want people to take action. So you need to lead the way, right? Because you know the path. So you need to lead the way when you share. What's next? It's okay to tell people what to do. It's okay to say, click the link below now to get the thing that you're offering. We'll talk about lead magnets next. Um, it's okay to say, we're going to get on a call 
and you're going to watch a video or you're going to say, we're going to meet at this place at noon on Thursday, you can be declarative. You have to take people's hand and tell them what to do, right? A call to action on a website is just that. So making sure that whatever information that you share, maybe you share a recipe for dryer balls. You want to have a call to action at the end of that blog post recipe or at the end of that email to get in touch with you or to download a, um, a, another recipe, a lead magnet, again, that we'll talk about in a second, that'll get them onto your email list so that you can promote to them all the time, right? It's okay to tell them what to do because they're not going to get the benefit that you know how to get if you don't show them what's next. It's not pushy, it's leadership, all right? Now they won't get those results if you don't show them how and what to do next. A little bit of a repeater, get ahead of myself here. <laughs> all right, now, if you aren't collecting leads, you aren't in business, all right? In terms of having a website, if you aren't collecting information from people, their names and their email addresses or even their phone numbers, then you aren't in business, all right? So when you're set up to collect leads, you can put an end to chasing people down to come to classes, sit down with you for presentations, watch videos or whatever. You don't have to chase people down when you've got leads. When people come to your website and they opt in for something of value that you're sharing with them, and, and they, they give you their contact information in exchange for something that you know that they want to know, those are people who are interested in what else you have to share. Those are people who you don't have to chase. Those are people who will show up when they say, I'm interested, please show me, and they follow through, right? They're qualified leads. You get these when you are following these strategies with an effective website. You can also build a list of people who aren't ready to purchase yet, right? How many of you have, a, how many of you would agree but that for the vast majority of folks that you have shown Young Living to, they've said, yes, but not right now, right? Maybe when I get my paycheck or that's great, I'm not ready, right? Very common, see? We want to be able to work with these folks to continue to provide value to these people and, and, and to grow, the, grow and nurture those relationships, even though they aren't ready right now. Because remember, this, this isn't just a transactional business for you. This isn't just about making money. This is about changing lives, right? So you're on a mission to help change lives. And if someone's not ready to dive in yet, that's okay. If you're collecting leads, you can continually send out valuable information that further fosters trust and develops a relationship and helps them feel more empowered to make those big life-changing decisions, like ditching and switching. Like for a lot of people, that's a really big decision. It's a financial decision, it's a personal decision, maybe they're really analytical and they wanna do the research, what have you. The conversation doesn't end when they say, I'm not ready right now, right? So if you are collecting leads on your website, you've got that way to nurture people moving forward. You can also automate your relationship building and your educating of people, right? So how many times have you sat down with how many different people repeating the same thing over and over again about what an essential oil is and why you shouldn't get them on Amazon? What if your website said that for you? How many more people could you share that with, show that information to, if it wasn't just you speaking to one person at a time, right? And, and this is really important. You can reach out and be heard whenever you want. Again, when you're posting on Facebook or Instagram or, or in a group that you've created or wherever, you don't have control over whether the people that, that, that you have collected as a following or as a community, you don't have control over whether or not they actually see what you share. If you're collecting leads from your website, then you've got emails and phone numbers that you can send your messages and information out to whenever you want, and it's your control. 
because it's your real estate, right? You're not renting, you're owning. And then finally, you're building the perfect audience to promote to because these are people who resonate with you, with your story, with your journey, believe that you're someone who can help them get to where they want to be in life. And of course, those are going to be the people that are going to respond exponentially more positively when it comes time to share a promotion. Obviously, you do want to promote sometimes, but the majority of the time you want to be building value and trust so that when you do promote, people say yes, right? All right, so who wants to see the five elements in action? I'm going to show you this uh, on a Good Oiling website. Uh, we're going to look at this, uh, and, and interestingly enough, this is not even highly... Um, it's not even highly customized. All right, so I'm gonna ex exit this presentation, come back to video and see some of our chat here and our Q&A, um, and, cause I can't see that when I'm doing my presentation, unfortunately. All right. Okay, Kathy, your question um, about whether or not you have Get Oiling and use it with separate services. Um, Kathy, this, this is actually for everyone. So if you have a Get Oiling website, uh, we're talking about some of the elements that you need to make sure that you incorporate into your website for best practices. Um, all right, let's see. Jim, will we get access to see the awesome website? Yes, Jim. <laughs> I will be sharing a fabulous website uh, that I did mention last week from one of our very own members who has highly customized a beautiful website here. All right, um, Jacqueline, good to have you here. Hello, Susie. Hello, hello. It's good to see everyone here. All right, fantastic. Um, okay, so I am going to pop over and share. Oops, there we go. All right, so I'm not gonna share these in order because this is not the way that, um, that you see them on a website, but I'm gonna call them out, all right? And I think that you will know what I'm talking about here. Uh, let me see. I should be sharing, where is it? All right, here we go. So let me know if you can see this, um, Holistic Mama, Jane Jones, Unlock the Secret to Better Health and Wellness. Quick hand. Perfect. Thank you so much. All right. So what we're looking at right now is a landing page. Now, what a landing page is, is an opportunity to deliver a lead magnet. I'm going to stop my video because I want you to see the whole screen here. All right. So you have an opportunity to deliver a lead magnet. Now, all a lead magnet is... All a lead magnet is, is a piece of information or, or a, a collection of information, however you choose to use it, uh, that you can deliver to someone that helps them solve a problem. So just to give you an example right here, you could say unlock this secret to better health and wellness. And just FYI, you guys, this is, uh, this is a pre-built theme. I may have altered a single sentence on this. Um, this is already written for you inside Get Oiling. All you have to do is plug, plug a couple of things. We've got trainings inside of our system that show you how to do this really simple stuff. Um, but anyway, so this says, these gifts from nature are powerful and pure and used by millions of people every day. Find out the treasure that is helping people live a healthier lifestyle and bring passion, purpose, and abundance to millions daily. Unlock this secret now and get my free guide, Five Steps to Healthier Living. Now this, this thing right here, you guys, Five Steps to Healthier Living, this guide, this is our lead magnet. Now what happens is we put in our name. You could put in a phone number. You could require this if you wanted to put people onto a text campaign. That's a whole other presentation. We're not talking about that in this training today. And then we're going to hit this button. Now, first, I want to show you something. Um, this is uh, the way that we have this setting set up is on the home page for Jane. Uh, and this is a, a stock account. This is one that we use for demos. Um, for Jane, uh, she has this as her homepage. So when we go to uh, fill this out, we're actually going to land on her website. And this is a, a website that's preloaded, pre-made. It's a website theme uh, that Greg designed for Get Oiling. Um, and when I'm done showing you guys this, I'm going to also show you a highly customized site and, and show you what it looks like when you take this to the next level. 
anyway, so when you scroll down, you can actually see that Jane uh, has her message right here. Now, you remember when I said clarity of message, right? So this is what Jane says. I believe every family should be empowered with the knowledge, tools, and support to live their healthiest, most abundant lives. I'm on a mission to build up communities by helping families realize true holistic wellness in all areas of life. Join me on this journey. Together, we can change the world. Contact me to learn more about how you can begin empowering your own family and community today. And then you can hit the contact here and contact her. So you remember that call to action I mentioned? Contact me to learn more and the button's right there. All you have to do in your Get Oiling site is right in your, um, under personalize my site, uh, you can actually add your story and the contact button's already there. It pops up and it shares all your information. Perfect, right? Anyway, so we've got a call to action here. We've got our message here. We're clear, we're clear on who we're talking to and what we're sharing, right? This is, this is very clear. And also, unlock this secret now and get my free guide. You put in the information, unlock this secret, call to action. These are, we're, we're compelling people to take the next step. We're showing them exactly what to do next. Now, here's what happens. When we hit this button right here, a couple of things are gonna happen. I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna go ahead and do this. All right, now it's going to take you over to her Get Oiling website. And here you've got navigation where you can learn. Lots of good stuff here. You've got a blog that we can click off to. There's an opportunity page. There's a contact page. There's an order page. Now, this is stock. This is what, like, this is already made for you. And when you hit learn more, it goes down to the next section where you can learn more about Jane. And then there's, there's videos here that talk about health and wellness. They talk about seed to seal. They, they show featured products. And by the way, these do click off to Young Living. Right, so for antioxidant, for pain relief, in this instance, we have multiple themes for beauty, uh, for babies, for animals, uh, lots of stuff here. Uh, but these actually click off and go straight to Young Living with your um, with your member and your member uh, ID number and your enroller ID. So people would automatically sign up for you if they decided to go straight off of the website. But it's all here for you. It's pre-made. It shares information, and then it shows you where you can go for what's next. It's got the product guide, all this kind of stuff. So this is what's this is already here. Place an order. It's already here. So if you're just getting started and you want something that's already done for you, this is this is just test down here, guys. By the way, <laughs> we use this website uh, uh, for testing out and for demonstrating. But uh, if if you are just getting your feet wet, uh, this is a way to differentiate yourself. It has the links. It has the information. Uh, you want just a simple way that you can share Young Living and, and give it your personal spin. It's all right here, ready to go. You can have a blog here where this is, this is actually the blog post where we're testing out our new fonts and colors. Um, you could also add blogs from elsewhere. You can add blog feeds. There's lots of stuff there. Anyway. So what happens after you opt in is I, Ashley, since I opted in on her landing page, uh, I get this email from her. And guys, by the way, you have this already set up in your system if you have Get Oiling. You already have a lead magnet and a funnel that you can use right now, okay? So here's how this works. You get an email that says, hey, congratulations, you've signed up for the newsletter. Could you do me a favor? Answer these quick questions and you'll get my free report, Five Steps to Healthier Living. It'll only take a couple of minutes and here's the link. Okay, so you click the link there and it goes to this page here. It says, tell me a little more about you, your situation and your goals. What are you looking, for, looking to achieve? And as a thank you, you'll get my free report, Five Steps to Healthier Living. So this is what your prospect does, you guys. Your prospect goes here and says, okay, I want better wellness okay, improve finances. I want that too. Um, weight management and, uh, yeah, I guess tell me more about essential oils. And then you can write in your goals here, right. As the prospect. So I'm looking to, to lose 10 pounds or I'm dealing with X, Y, Z issue. And they put that in and they hit, get my free report. Now on the next page, 
after you fill that out, there's a thank you, and then you hit download my free report. Now what you get, Get Oiling User, <laughs> is an email immediately that you have a new contact, that you have a new lead, and it shares with you what they're interested in, their goals, improved finances, natural cleaning, healthy person, personal skincare, weight management, and then the message, I'm coming up on a milestone birthday and I'm ready to make some serious changes in my life, my career, and my body. I've been following you for years on Facebook. I want to know your secrets. If you got a message like that in your inbox right now, how quick would you pick up the phone and call that person? Right? That's someone who is ready to know something right now. Now, that's what you get when someone opts in on that page that we were on just a few minutes ago. Oops. Now, I'll show you what the free report looks like. I thought I had that open. Sorry about that, guys. One second. Here it is. All right, so this is the guide. Five steps to healthier living. Again, you already have this if you are a Get Oiling user. Uh, this is preloaded into your campaigns. It's a new prospects campaign. So you can actually get that entire step-by-step -step where folks will go in and select the, um, the thing that they wanna learn more about and share with you what their goals are. And you get that email that tells you what they're looking for and they get this. Five Steps to Healthier Living. It's a nice PDF that talks about mindset and food and natural and personal care products and things like that. It's all really nice and pretty. Move more, drink more water, bonus step, get the, minor, the right amount of rest. Um, so people get this guide, right? When they, when they sign up, that is a lead magnet. So if you're wondering, oh, well, how do I even create one? You have one already. When you get started with Get Oiling for a dollar, or if you're here already and you're wondering how you can get more leads off of your website, get more people opting in, let them know. I have a guide, Five Steps to Healthier Living, and all you have to do is use that new prospects campaign or duplicate the new prospects campaign and add to it as you wish. Personalize it, all right? And you'll get all of those uh, email notifications of people coming in and saying, hey, please tell me more. This is, this is the kind of thing I wanna learn more about, right? And then of course, you've got your website as well where people can go and learn about the opportunity if they want to. And this is all customizable, by the way. Uh, if, if you want to leave that off of, um, off of the menu, there are settings for that. You can make this totally, totally custom. All right, so while we are here um, and we're still on the Get Oiling um, website, before I go and show you guys a highly customized site, do you have any questions for me? Is there anything that you would like to know while we're still here about your Get Oiling website? And just to reiterate, these themes, what you see here for healthy living, there's more of this. And these images that you see up here at the top, you can customize them. You can make them look however you want them to. Pretty, pretty exciting. All right, so if we don't have any questions about uh, the website or the website templates, um, remembering, guys, those, those primary pieces of a great website. You've got your clarity of message, easy na navigation, authentic and valuable content. That is definitely something that you want uh, to, to use via a blog or through an email. That lead magnet is authentic, valuable content that you can share. It's a great place to start. Um, a strong, clear call to action. And of course, using those lead magnets to be able to convert leads um, or convert interested people into leads on your website. All right, uh, let's see, Diane, is this easy to find? Yes, this is, um, it's actually quite easy to find. I'm going to, here, let me show you really quick. Okay, just a second, I'm going to change my user here. Okay, so where you would wanna to go to set those things up is actually 
uh, under my site settings. There's customize my site, my story and photo. It's very easy to get to. If When you sign up actually for Get Oiling, uh, you are automatically enrolled if you are at, at basic and above, and that's where you can get started for a dollar. Um, you're automatically enrolled in Destined for Diamond where we actually hold your hand and walk through step-by-step -step via email. Uh, you get a lesson and then an implementation step and then a day off. So you, every every couple of days, you've got a new thing to do and implement and then go out and use to grow your business. And this is definitely a step that we cover here. All right, uh, Dixie, can I use my own domain? Yes, and we absolutely recommend that you do. Um, it just makes for better branding and it's easier for you to share. So yourname.com, yourbusiness.com, absolutely. All right. Tammy, can we email or text through the site directly to contacts and leads? Yes, absolutely. What we're looking at right now is our dashboard and inside it, you've got a contact manager where you can manage campaigns, which is where you would deliver the lead magnet, like what I was showing just a little while ago. But through manage, you can actually take an action and text or mail your contacts. Obviously, this is a test account and it really only has me here as a lead. Uh, so yes. Um, yes, you absolutely can. Uh, we have two-way texting. Uh, we've got text message broadcasting. It's really everything that you need to put yourself out there and share uh, what you have to say and your message and your vision to the world and communicate with people directly and on an automated basis as well. Um, all right, so when I look for this, Diane asks, is it the one done for you or are there several? Ah, okay. So what I'm talking about uh, in terms of the theme, Diane, if you go under customize my site, you go to the website theme and you've got all these themes right here that you can explore. And then you can also customize by adding pictures and things like that. All right. All right. Maria would like to know more about accepting payment for an event on my website. Have you done a training on that yet? Uh, Maria, that is, let me see, I would check the table of contents for the 90 day challenge. It's right up here under health, uh, help, excuse me. Um, under the 90 day challenge is a table of contents. Uh, there is one where we talk about using events. Um, right now, there's a couple of ways to go about doing that, whether you have Stripe or PayPal that you want to integrate. So if you want to do like a, a, a make and take type of deal and you want to collect payment online, uh, there are some ways for you to do that. Um, and if you are having trouble with it, um, there, I know there's definitely some, some written instruction on the page. Definitely reach out to us, info at getoilink.com. We can help clarify that for you. All right, Jacqueline. Is there a template for the types of guides to use or a limit of what to share? If you could clarify that for me a little bit further, um, the types of guides are, are, if, are you talking about lead magnets or, you know, something along the lines of, of that, um, of, of that, uh, that guide that was given away in, in the lead magnet that I shared just a moment ago, let me know. And I'm happy to answer. Um, let me see, Dixie. Uh, do you have a yoga essential oil theme for the website? Is it easy to customize? We don't have a yoga one specifically, but you can absolutely customize it for yoga or anything else that you'd like. And then in, in just a few minutes here, I'm going to give you an example of someone who has set theirs up um, very specifically with, with, with a very... Um, a very it were just with a very very specific theme they could have used one of ours but they really made it their own so i'm going to show you that here in just a minute and that should give you some uh some inspiration on how you can use this to integrate yoga for sure because it's totally possible all right tammy can we own, add our own content like videos are there other lead magnets for different themes so the the included lead magnet is just the one that i've shared with you but you can make others and it's very simple and we have tons of training on how you can do just that uh, how you can create different kinds of funnels that that share and help in different ways and provide different kinds of value to your prospects all right uh jacqueline yes for people to sign up in the lead magnets um in, in terms of template it's the, really the sky's the limit i would recommend that you um go out and uh and and, and look around online I, I recommend this to anyone uh, go and find brands personal brands or experts that you um that maybe you, you currently follow maybe you're subscribed to their their email marketing lists, and look at their website and see what they're offering 
right? One of the best things that you can do is offer something that's quick and actionable. So something, you know, five steps, a recipe. Um, it doesn't need to be an ebook, right? It doesn't need to be a seven step video or, or seven video series. Um, some of the best converting lead magnets, meaning the stuff that, that gets people to take action that exists in the email marketing or in internet marketing world are things that are short and sweet and help somebody get a thing done quickly. So just keep that in mind. It doesn't have to be extensive or complicated. It's quite easy to turn, um, you know, a picture or a, um, even a Word document into a PDF that's downloadable. That's exactly what you saw there, and that's included uh, with the uh, New Prospects campaign inside of Getaway Lane. So there's a lot of inspiration out there. I would just say keep it simple and keep it authentic to you, and just make it as helpful and actionable as possible. All right. So let's see if I don't have anything else in the chat here. I'm going to pop over. Okay, Jim asks, uh, there is a, a list of campaigns. How can I see what is sent out without registering myself? If you go and you click on the campaigns, you can actually see, here I'll show you real quick before I go and demo this other site. If you go to campaigns, you can see a list of campaigns that you've already written, and you could also see the ones that are preloaded by Get Oiling. See, we have lots of campaigns that are already uh, already here. So new prospects is the campaign that, uh, that I demonstrated for you guys that actually includes that gift. So a couple days from now, I'm going to receive another email that says, what's this all about? So you can actually go in and see what it says. You don't have to send it to yourself. Um, although you certainly could if you wanted to, and if you want to say, take inspiration from something that we've already created, you can just hit this button right here and call it, uh, uh, let's see, new prospects one. You duplicate that. So there's my new prospects one, and now you can actually edit it. You can add another email to it. You can change the links in it. You can write other things inside of it. So there's actually a lot that you can do here. All right. Now, Kathy says, I had mine set for newsletter. However, I think I'll change my lead magnet to a guide they can print. Yeah, absolutely. So people, um, few people sign up just wanting a newsletter, right? Now, if, if they have a relationship with you already, um, then anything of value that you provide is something that, that they're going to be willing to exchange their information for so that you can email them. Um, I would always ask yourself, would I give up my email address for this, right? Does this solve a problem that I would be willing to, you know, to sacrifice the crowdedness of my email inbox for? <laughs> so making sure that it's specific to the person that, that you want to help and it's truly helpful to them in a way that is actionable and makes sense. Um, and then it's very easy for folks to say, oh yeah, here, yes, please take my email and tell me everything that you know because I find you extraordinarily helpful, right? Okay. Now I want to talk to you guys about taking this to the next level. Uh, and, and I want to show you a fabulous example of a website from one of our members based in Singapore. Uh, this, they've, uh, their brand name or for their team is The Light Goes On. Um, their complimentary well-being for humans and animals using essential oils. And they have, um, they have such a loving, incredible relationship with their furry family members. And their online brand is all about that. Uh, this is a Get Oiling theme. They do have their own custom site menu here where you can learn more about them. You can learn about their upcoming events, their resources, articles. Um, you can place an order, learn about the starter kits, the monthly promo opportunity, and get in touch. I want to go through and show you these and actually tell you what they are in the back office if you want to kind of recreate um, some of what they've done here. Now, this is a custom page, right? So this isn't one of our themes. They've actually created a custom page and are using that as their homepage, okay? And the custom page is in your back office of Get Oiling. It's right back here under My Site Settings and Custom Pages. So they built this page with a custom page. So they are sharing that they are advocates for safe and holistic products and practices for humans and animals using essential oils. Pretty cool. And they're very clear about it. People, animal, well-being, and wisdom. And this goes to their about page. So let's go ahead and go there since that's what they're telling us to do, right? 
learn more. This is so great. All right, so About the Light Goes On, and they have a phenomenal video here. And this is just on YouTube. This is free, you guys. This is on their YouTube channel. And they have, they've, they've just plugged it in. And again, this is another custom page using the same, same thing as we just, as I just pointed you guys to. So they tell more about what they're about, who they help, what this means to them. They've got some really cool images that they've incorporated here. They've got some branding that they've incorporated about people, animals, and well-being. This is really great. And this is shareable too, because see, they've got their website here, thelightgoeson.com. It goes straight to their Get Oiling website, the page we were just on, right? Oh, oh, and now they're telling us here, look at this. So there's more stories here where they talk about their um, their tabby and 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 how tabby was uh, discovered in the, out in traffic and hadn't gotten hit, but was just frozen and how lavender helped to uh, lavender put on to one of the humans helped the cat uh, to, to become more okay with the world uh, after it was rescued, right? So now again, remember that call to action we were talking about and the navigation? Now they're telling us to go here. So let's go here, let's find out more. Here's our resources. Now, if I could make one suggestion to them, I would turn this into a lead magnet and ask that we uh, enter our information and that there's a little bit more of a sale of what's next. This isn't bad, it's just a recommendation. All right, so what we have here are resources that we're talking about essential oils, how they can enhance your mental, emotional, and physical and energetic well being. So now you've got videos where you're learning different things about cleansing and uh, and, and ways to use oils and how you can stay tuned for updates. Ah, there we go. There's our, there's, this is where we, we, we get ourselves locked in. So stay in touch. Let us know. We want to hear more. I want to see more of what you make because I love what you've shared with me so far. I've seen four videos. You've shared stories with me that have connected to my soul. I am so happy to learn more from you too. Please, please share it with me. And so when you put your information in here, then you can continue to hear more from them. All right. So that's fabulous. So when you hit keep, keep me posted, this pops up. Again, this is a custom page. These are all built on Get Oiling custom pages. It's under my site settings. Now let's play around on the site menu here, going back to their, their homepage. Actually, let's, let's continue scrolling on their homepage. So remember we started up here at the top. Now going down, we learned more about them, right? This took them to about and then to resources. So let's go back here. There's upcoming events and classes, find out more. Here's their events coming up. They have a make and take workshop coming up in uh, just a little, a little under a couple weeks from now where you can actually register. They've got a pretty image here. Now this is, again, this is a very easy thing to set up and, and your website.com forward slash events. Uh, if you have events listed in your events manager and get oiling, you can do this as well. This can be a menu item on your website uh, so that if people wanna explore further, they want to, uh, to actually attend an event with you, or maybe it's a make and take like this one, um, then they have that opportunity to explore that. Now going back to this main page here, they have a video from their uh, their YouTube channel that's borrowed from Young Living about what essential oils are, right? Of course, they have the disclaimers for um, uh, for for the purpose of being compliant, right? And then they even actually go into talking about Young Living, and this is something that's on our standard website theme where we talk about uh, you know why seed to seal, what's different, and so you can play that video here. Ooh, there's a learn more. Where does that go? Ooh, seed to seal right there on the website. Pretty cool, right? So going back to that page, they've also, and this, this kind of echoes what you see in the Get Oiling themes. They have their own logos where they have included different blends. And these all link off to Young Living and their sponsored and roller ID numbers, which is brilliant. Good job. It's actually quite simple to do. And we have trainings on that in the help section of Get Oiling. Also on our many weekly work session recordings that you can find at youtube.com forward slash Get Oiling. If we want to get started now, you can click that button and it takes you off to choose your membership and see it's, it's linked up to them. Pretty awesome, right? Let me get back to that page. 
And then you can explore the starter kit. Now they're based in Singapore. So these are all, you know, everything that's here is, is Singapore specific. Now all of our stock web pages, the stuff that's pre-built with themes are built to be compliant for different markets. So you get to pick the market that you're in, right? Um, that's, that's there, but you also have this option to, uh, to customize. If you wanted to personal brand all the way across and not even talk about Young Living at the outset, but give people the opportunity to get in touch with you first before you start sharing and promoting in that way, then you can do that this way as well. Okay, so that's their homepage. I wanna go to the site menu and show you. We saw the about. There's also a who because there's more than one person here. So we've got Jackie and we've got Janet and they have their stories. And then it links back to the about page. Now let's go back to our site menu here. Sorry about that, you guys. All right, um, you've got upcoming events. You've got resources, we've seen that one. Articles, this is their blog. And let's see, so she've got, she's got one blog post here where you can learn more about becoming an animal well-being educator. Oh, this is great. Very cool. So she's got links off here to where you can actually get started with products that she's talking about. There's an about section. Very cool. You can also place an order here, learn about the starter kits. Here's another cool one, you guys. Promotion. This is a great idea. Everyone should do this. It, this is the latest promotions. You could call this the monthly promotion. Uh, you could give your own image here or use whatever image you like. Uh, and then when at the end of the month or the first of the month rather, when you get the monthly PV promos, you just link it off right here. So this is the May promotion. You just add the link to that button. Oh boy, where'd I go? Right there, sorry. <laughs> you just add the link to that button. You download the promo details here. This will download the actual PDF of the promote the month, the May promo for Singapore. And then of course there's a get started kit. What a valuable resource, right? You could actually have a promo page that doesn't change and you could just send that link out once a month after you go in and you update it to reflect the new, um, the new promotion for the month. So you don't have to write a whole new thing each month, right? All right, and then you've got the opportunity page, and this is actually our standard. You guys might have seen this already, but this is the one that already shows up as a, a, um, a system generated, we already made this for you page for Young Living for you to share the opportunity. Uh, it shares the income disclosure statement, the comp plan details, it links off here to a video, um, you can uh, you can actually change the video that you use here. You can really customize this to the full extent that you want. All right, so let me see, going back to, yeah, see the opportunity page right here is the exact same thing. So you can have that too. All right, so Tammy asks, in your example, it's a group sharing site. Okay, we're talking about the, the customized one. Um, how do you handle links to purchase if you share as a group? Is there a way to have each member's link listed with their picture or short profile? So my recommendation as a practice, Tammy, is that you, as individual business builders, have your own site because you want to generate your own leads. Now, where you have folks who are just getting started, uh, who you want to help and give them a link, you know, just, just so they, they can get out there and make it easier. There's a couple of things that you can do. And let me, let me show you. Um, in your about section under my story and photo, if you want to have multiple folks that are represented here, in this story text right here, you can include images and stories and links to multiple team members. There are definitely people who do that this way. Um, and then you would just share a particular site, but then you would have to figure out, you know, who's connected to who, and we're really set up for you as an individual business, right? Another thing that you can do, and, and this is the most helpful way for you to help your members uh, who aren't quite ready to maybe get a site yet, is to go over here to leg builder and go to settings 
and that's where you're going to change the um, the member number and uh, and the enroller number. And this gives you the instructions here. And you can actually create leg builder links for people who are in your organization. So when they share that link and people purchase through it, then that's their sale. Okay, that's really the best way to do it. You can create multiple leg builder links in this way. But where we're talking about as a practice employing the strategies that I'm talking about today, it's far more effective uh, for, for each of us as distributors to have our own. Uh, because, I mean, in, in the big picture, you know, your business is not your downlines business, it's yours and vice versa. Uh, and of course, we try to make this as, uh, as simple as possible, admitting that it is not the simplest thing, but it is something that is worth learning how to do. Uh, and we try to make that accessible by providing this training for you. And of course, uh, getting you your first month for a dollar so you can get that momentum going and get things set up quickly, even if you're brand new. All right, so uh, Suzanne, where do you go to make a custom menu? Great question. You go right over here to customize my site. I'm sorry, maybe I went, no, this isn't it. <laughs> you do wanna go here and change things around. You go to my site settings and you go to site menu and you get to move things around. If you want them to be in a different order, you get to add, add something new, um, you give it a name, you choose the space, uh, you choose what kind of thing it is, uh, you name it, you give it a URL. So this would be, so for instance, if you wanted to do what the, the ladies from the light goes on uh, would like, uh, would have done like say for their homepage, uh, then you would say, uh, you would put that, the link to your custom page that you wanna use right here, right? Or if you wanted your about me to be something that was separate on a custom page, you would put that right here. Um, and you can choose to have it open in a new window or not. So you can create, sorry about that, cancel, okay. Um, yeah, so you can edit that, again, that's under site menu, under my site settings. All right. Great, do we have any other questions? All right, Dixie, should I use myname.com for my domain or is it better for branding to use what my focus topic uh, it.com? So Dixie, the answer is, uh, it's not particularly complicated, although it can change based on, uh, on your existing business. So if you say have a, um, if you have a yoga focused business that you wanna integrate oils into, um, and, and it's an established yoga business and, and you wanna you know, really fo have that be the, the primary focus and Young Living being something that is sort of supportive and adjacent, then you can be more yoga focused in the brand name that you use. Uh, what I advocate for 9.9 .9 times out of 10, however, is that you use yourname.com, yourname.com, um, because your brand is what people connect with. Your brand, you personally, is the, um, is the reason why people trust you. It's the reason why people follow you. It's why they give you their information. It's why they want to take your recommendations. Um, you can really confuse people and get people kind of conflating value if you try to get them to latch on to different brand names. Now, as in the instance with our example website here today, um, they've decided to use a brand name. But this is, this is two people building a business together, right? So if you want to focus on that brand, just make sure that you have really clear, um, you know, clear vision and clear language about who it is that you're trying to help, how and why. Um, but if you as an individual are building this as an individual, which is the case for the majority of people, I would, I would just have it be your name. All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, I'm going to, in our chat here, uh, Diane, I'm, I'm going to share the link here. All right. Any other questions before we get going? I'm so glad you guys were able to come today. You have such great questions. Um, I do want to remind you, going over to, you know, getoiling.com, if you aren't with us as a member already, you can get started today for a dollar, um, and you have all of the training that you need. Um, one final thing I want to touch on before I forget, oh my goodness, um, 
just one more thing I want to talk to you guys about how to use your website as a business tool. This is really important. We hit the Q and A's a little too early. All right. So using your site as a business tool, just a second, these fields don't work for me when I expand. All right, here we go. Let's talk about using your site as a business tool first personalize that URL like we were just talking about Dixie and use that link wherever you have an online profile. This is where it makes even more sense to have it as your name.com as opposed to a brand name.com. Unless of course you are in a partnership or some other unique circumstance, put that, that business tool, your link to your website, not only in your social profiles, but in your email signature. Put it on your business cards, on flyers that you hand out at trade shows and local events. Blog on your website and share your content on social media. That's how people start to see that, oh, she's not just here to promote. Man, wow, I just learned something amazing from you. When are you gonna do that again? Oh yeah, you posted something else? I wanna read that too. Oh, you, you can recommend a product? Of course I wanna see that, right? So blog on your website and share your content on social media and use your blog to share Young Living long distance. I put an asterisk here because it's not just about long distance, right? If you are, and I said use your blog, use your website as entirely to share Young Living, whether it's long distance or nearby, you have a way, like especially using the Get Oiling website, if you have some of these systems set up for yourself, so say if you have a, a lead magnet that teaches the basics of essential oils and people go through that course and they're ready to set up an appointment with you for you to share with them the way that they can get started with the best possible essential oil kit that they can find uh, at 24% off of retail for forever, right? Um, you can use your website with people in your area who you can't get to sit down locally, right? Or with people who are on the other side of the world. This becomes a thing that allows you to share with more people more quickly in volume exponentially, right? This allows people to come to you ready to learn more. And if you're doing enough to get your clear message out there and share the value that you have to offer, share what you know that other, people's need, other people need to know, then you're going to always have enough people to talk to and to share Young Living with. And of course, you can use your website to incorporate tools that share Young Living and teach concepts like basics of essential oils and seed to seal and things like that using your website. So you don't have to go one on one on one on one and take up all of that time when you could create one tool that shares and buys your time back. Pretty cool, right? And you can get your own site and so much more, your complete business system, everything that you need to grow Young Living online, aside from your virtual office, all in one place for a dollar for your first month. Head over to getoiling.com to get started. I wanna go back to the Q and A's. Thank you guys for sticking out for so long here today and asking so many great questions. I want to come back and chat with you guys and we'll be on our way. All right, uh, let's see. So, oh, so great question about the email address, Kathy. So with Get Oiling, you can actually have your custom email address. So if you set up your uh, yourname.com, you can then have, you know, your name at yourname.com or info at yourname.com or however you would like for that to come up. So that is something that you can do as well. It's a customization feature. When you get started with us, if you get into Destined for Diamond, the step-by-step -step training, totally free. Um, 30 days walks you through everything you need to know about setting up and using the system and putting it into action for your business. One of those steps is getting that custom email address, getting that custom domain, just because it's so professional and it's easy, right? It's instead of saying I'm, you know, ABC12345 at gmail.com or whatever. No, I am, I am my name at my name.com. Um, it sounds more professional and it's easier to share. All right. Jim asks, uh, I have created business pages in Facebook and of Instagram under a different brand name, not my personal brand name. Would it be best to get a domain under this name? So unless, uh, unless it is not possible for you to change the name of an existing account that you have on social media, um, well, actually, okay, I, I put it this way. Unless you have tens, and, uh, tens of thousands of followers uh, who are relevant to your, the, the purpose that, that you're working toward here above and beyond Young Living, right? As, as a part of a greater picture for you. Um, the people that you wanna help, who you wanna attract. Unless you have tens of thousands of followers, go ahead and rebrand. 
it, it's, it's never a bad thing to start over because if you're starting over with purpose, you're starting over with greater clarity. It's going to get you to where you want to go more quickly and with more precision. So I would, I would use your, um, your name.com, uh, nine times out of 10. Yourname.com is the best brand. Your name is the best brand because we're branding you. It's your story. It's your influence. Maybe you have a tagline. Maybe you want to specify who you're helping and, and, and what you're about in terms of your brand. Uh, but, but, but it's really, it's, it's not overcomplicated. A lot of us, you know, really muck up the process and think that like, okay, I'm going to brand myself. I've got to come up with something catchy. No, it's, it's you. It's, it's who you are authentically. It's who you're helping. It's how you're helping them. And it's the way that you like how you got to where you are that qualifies you for being able to help those people. And it's really just as simple as showing up in that way, providing something of value and being consistent about it. Uh, that's, that's like the key to being a successful personal brand. Um, all right, Laurel, uh, if you go to getoiling.com, uh, there is uh, there are a couple of orange buttons on the page that say sign up for a dollar and uh, it'll show you the different levels that you can start at. There's actually several you can start at for a dollar for your first month. Fabulous. Let me see if we have any more questions here. Mm, okay, so you use your last name, wellness.com, Diane. Hmm. Well, that's it's not a bad call, right? So you are using your last name. Um, I would I would I would get your first name, last name.com and just have it. Um, you know, if if it's possible for you to get it, if it's available. I mean, it costs like, you know, what, 10, 12 bucks a year. Um, I would go ahead and get that and then, you know, spend some time kind of, you know, reflecting on, on how you really want to be developing, uh, your brand, your brand. What is it that you're talking about? Are you talking about more than just wellness? Right. Do you, do you, um, see, so here's the thing we just went through, uh, an amazing transformative, uh, personal branding intensive, uh, with a group of people here, some of our members here in Get Oiling. And a lot of people realized that they were kind of putting themselves in a hole in terms of their personal brands, um, just because they were trying to uh, force uh, a concept, uh, for, force a concept in this situation that wasn't exactly them authentically. See, everybody's got a reason for why they joined Young Living, for why the products are life changing to them. And that's your unique story. You don't need to be a wellness advisor if you're not. You may discover, like someone did in our group, that they are actually more along the lines of personal development, right? And 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 our oil's not perfect for that too, right? So there's there's a lot. Uh, there's a lot that you have to offer, and you just want to make sure that you're not um, minimizing your greatness by slapping an extra qualifier on there. I think your name allows for you to become as expansive as you need to be. Um, and I, I think that I think that Oprah did a great job with that. I think she's a perfect personal brand to consider in that way. She is just her name. And that's all you need to be because your name is you and you are fabulous enough and, uh, and spectacular enough to run this business and change enough lives to go RCD and beyond, right? Um, in terms of offering the class again, we'll be in touch about that. Keep an eye out on your email. Uh, it is possible that that might open up after convention. We will let you know. All right. So we have gone over quite a bit today. Thank you so much for sticking around, for, uh, for asking all these great questions. And be sure to tune in next week. You'll have a Q&A with Greg, who will be able to break down more of the tech how-to because he built the system after all. Um, all right, so look forward to seeing you then. Be sure and invite a friend next time. And if you aren't started with us yet, please go ahead and do. It's getoiling.com and click the button. You can get started with us today for a dollar. We love you and we will see you next week. Take care.